Okay, so the top three applications right now are uh, Remote, Facebook, Light, Weatherbug, Tap Tap Revenge, Box Office, iPint, um, Phone Saber. Uh, sorry, one second. Phone Saber, iMaze. New York Times, uh, Cube Runner, Where, AIM, uh, AIM, whichever you prefer to say, Currency, YP Mobile, Mobile News Network, Blip Solitaire, E Reader, To Do, Bubbles, Check Please, Twitterific, Mixmeister Scratch, I think it's called, uh, Epocrates RX, and Net Newswire. Those are the top 25. So, I think I'm going to check out currency right now. So, as you can see, it will uh, it gives you information about the app, and then it gives you a screenshot of what it looks like. And uh, I'm not sure. I know on uh, the iTunes app store, like on the computer in iTunes, uh, you can browse through multiple screenshots of it, but on the iPod and iPhones version of the app store, it seems like you can only view one screenshot. Then at the bottom, you can view reviews, popularity, the data that was posted, the version, and the company. Uh, currently, there are no reviews for this one. I don't think I'm going to get this one. It's not what I was expecting. I was thinking it was a currency converter, but it doesn't seem like it is. Let's check out Bubbles. Okay, so it seems like all you gotta do here is pop Bubbles. And it doesn't sound too fun to me. Let's look at... Let's try iMaze. So the description for iMaze is an entertaining maze game in which you guide a ball from start to finish by tilting the iPhone in different directions. So that seems fairly simple to me. The screenshot hasn't loaded here. But um, let's try downloading it. So to download it, I tap free at the top here. Then I click install. Okay, my internet just quit on me. One second. Oh, jeez. Uh, okay, can't find my internet connection. So... Oh, wait, here it is. Okay, so I'm connected. Let's try downloading it again. And here's the screenshot now. Okay, so I hit free. I hit install. And then I click install. And it comes up and asks me to enter my password. So I'll enter that now, but obviously you can't see it. Then hit OK. And the icon appears on my home screen. And apparently my iTunes password was incorrect. One second, I'll try again. Hit OK. And it appears on my home screen again. And it says loading at the bottom, as you can see. Now, while it's loading, I can uh, do the hold down and drag to wherever I want to. So, since this is a game, I think I'll put it on my second page here. Uh, and 
it seems to be taking a really long time to load. Normally it's a lot faster. Maybe if I was closer to my internet connection, it would... Oh, here we go. It's installing now. It's about half done. Okay, you know what? You probably... I'm just going to cut out any huge gaps that I'm not saying anything in because it's really kind of pointless here and my internet connection just sucks. So, you know, I'm not even sure if what I just said will stay in the final version of the video. So here we have the almost finished downloading iMaze. Uh, normally, I'm not sure if this is just my connection or if it does this all the time, but it seems to stall at the final little uh, last amount to go when it's installing something. But if we'll just wait a bit, we'll see it finish. Okay, uh, here it is. It just finished installing now. And um, as you can see, obviously, it's appeared on our home screen. It says Hi Maze under the bottom, and if I click it, here it is. So I could tilt the accelerometer and it will control the ball for me. This kind of sucks. The ball doesn't really roll, it just appears right where I want to make it go. This is stupid. Okay. Um, so I hope you can, or I hope you do watch my videos throughout the rest of the week that I'll hopefully be posting with reviews. Um, I'm probably going to start with Super Monkey Ball for my first review. Um, so I'll see you then. Uh, thanks for watching. Bye.